Sure you do. Okay, I'm listening. Whatever program you're in, Lisa Calc, Lisa Wright, the way you use it is the same. I'll try it. That looks good. Okay, let's transfer the budget totals into the executive summary. Uh, do we type those in from scratch? No. We can take the figures from the spreadsheet. And move them into the text in Lisa Wright. Fantastic. Okay. Now that we've got the budget in shape, the last thing we need to do is revise the schedule. Uh, what happened to the budget? It's underneath the schedule, along with the other documents we were just working on and all the icons. It is. You know how you sometimes lose a paper on your desk under things? Not me. Here. One way to see what's underneath is by making the window smaller. That's the size control box in the lower right corner. Okay, keep the button pressed down and move up. Ah, oh, the missing budget as advertised. Okay, let's move the schedule over so we can compare it against the budget. Nothing easier. Ah. Mm -hmm. Like this with the pointer in the title bar? That's it. Hold the button down as you move it. All right, let's set the rest of this up. To activate a window, I click in it. Right. We're almost done. Yeah. third quarter figures? Uh, just a second. There they are. We're getting behind, Bill. All right. I'll call the data processing service again. We'll finish the schedule. Be sure and have them confirm these projections, and I'll go ahead and work on the fourth quarter. Okay. Stanley, it's Bill. Okay, let's take an empty folder from the pad of folders. That's like a stack of folders, right? Mm-hmm. They're empty, so you can put things in them. You just select and tear one off. Ready to print? Uh, one second. Uh, I'll open the document and print it. They look terrific. The courier should be here in half an hour. Dinner on me this time? You're on. Got it? We sure did. Oh, right. That's wonderful. A little celebration? Oh, it certainly calls for it. To a job well done. And here's looking at you, kid. <laughs>